Never stop learning because life never stops teaching. Welcome to the Get It Hush Show live on TBP TV with me, your lawyer host, Jenny Love. The show is proudly brought to you by HS Media Institute and Alice Beauty Palo. HS Media Institute is approved by GES and affiliated to ICM UK. The school offers both diploma and HND courses in journalism and media. You can locate HS Media Institute of Amasaman Obom Highway inside the Woodney Plaza building. For more inquiries, contact HS Media Institute on 0244. 494-577-0244-494-577. Archers Media Institute, integrity with professionalism. Contact Alice Beauty Parlor for a flawless makeover and neat hair braids on 0559-542-558. 0559-542-558. A quick commercial break. We'll be right back. Salut, bonjour à tous. I'm Erika Josia, a proud former student of HS Media Institute. Thanks to HS Media, I achieved my goals and my dreams have come true. And today, I'm working as a journalist with the Pan-African TV, Africa News. To you who have always dreamt of becoming a great journalist, I will recommend to you only one school and the best one, HS Media Institute. With more than eight years of experience in training journalists from several countries, including Congo, Gabon, Kenya, and many more, Arches Media is the private media school you can really trust. Arches Media is located in Accra, Ghana. You can call them to the number below your screen. Arches Media, integrity with professionalism. Thanks for staying on. It's still that get it hot show live on TBP TV, where anything trending is saved. Hot, 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 and hot. Trending today. I had no accreditation in 2020 when I represented Mahama in EC Strong Room, Rojo. Rojo Meto Nono, a former minister and leading member of the National Democratic Congress, NDC, has revealed that he was an unaccredited agent of the party in the Electoral Commission Strong Room during the 2020 elections. In an interview on City FM on February 23, Roger recounted his footprints as a member of the NDC personnel at the EC in successive elections. He recounted serving the NDC in the 2008 elections in the strong room, which process led to John Evans Atamel's winning power on his third attempt. Roger added that his absence in the EC strong room was due to illness, but he was back in the place for 2020 elections despite not being accredited. In another story, Black Rasta lists deadly consequences of eating pork. Following Sonny Bedu's claim that eating pork easily exposes one to demonic attacks, popular broadcaster cum musician Black Rasta has also provided a tall list of hazards that pork could cause to one's health. Reverend Sonny Bedu's assertion have since sparked a heated debate among netizens, with a majority disputing the notion. But after chancing on all this, Black Rasta seconded the assertion that pork is indeed detrimental to humans. I don't know about pork filled with demons. The only time I saw pigs and demons cast into them was in the days of Jesus Christ where they all got drowned. But I know there are bigger demons in pork than what Sonny Bedu is talking about. Why should anyone be happy about eating pork? This is an animal that has all the abominable diseases. Black Rasta further tackled individuals who are found of eating meat and even slaughtering them. Why should you even kill the animal? The way you love your life is the same way the animal loves his life. Why do you want to kill the animal and eat it? Is it not barbarism? Why should any human being eat animal at all? Why should you eat it? Leave the animal and let it grow and live. You catch it and barbarically slaughtered it with so much violence. You cook it and eat. Then you are not ashamed to come out and say it is sweet, he added. To our last trending story for the day, I'm broke. Meet the 41-year-old behind the popular Ukoye Edentem. The social media sensation Kwekutewia, who is popularly called Staji, has bitterly revealed that he is very broke. The 41-year-old man recently became popular after his acronym Ukoye Eden, which translates to English as what did you go there to do? Went viral. Despite becoming a social media star overnight, the reality on the ground is that Star G is struggling financially. Speaking in an interview with Zion Felix, he disclosed that some people have perceived him to be financially stable, but he does not have any money. 
He added that even though he has no money, he has a lot of hope that things will get better one day. That's all for today on the Get It Hot Show Live with me, your lawyer host, Janela. The show was proudly brought to you by HS Media Institute and Alice Beauty Parlor. If today is your first time coming across my videos, kindly subscribe, comment, like, and share. Stay tuned for more updates.